Hello everyone. I am Sheba Samuel along with Frank Lofler and Brigitta Kuningries from Friedrich Schiller University, Germany, present a paper on machine learning pipelines, provenance, reproducibility and fair data principles. Over the last few years, advances in artificial intelligence and machine learning have led to their use in numerous applications. With more and more decision making and knowledge generation being based on machine learning, it becomes increasingly important that machine learning experiments are reproducible. Unfortunately, similar to other disciplines, machine learning also faces a reproducibility crisis. We define reproducibility as follows. A scientific experiment is said to be reproducible if the experiment can be performed to get the same or similar results by making variations in the original experiment. The variations can be done in one or more of the following variables non-computational steps, computational steps, order of execution, data, settings, agents, execution environment, and time. In this paper, we investigate which factors contribute this, to this crisis and propose first solutions to address some of them. We investigate which factors beyond the availability of source code and data sets influence reproducibility of machine learning experiments. We propose the application of fair data practices in end-to-end -end machine learning pipelines. We present our preliminary results on the role of our tool ProofBook in capturing and comparing provenance of machine learning experiments and their reproducibility using Jupyter Notebooks. A machine learning pipeline consists of a series of ordered steps used to automate the machine learning workflow. We conducted an internal study among 15 domain experts to understand what is needed to achieve reproducibility of machine learning experiments. We present here some relevant challenges and problems faced by scientists in machine learning in reproducing published results of others. Unavailability of complete source code, data sets used for training and evaluation, a reference implementation and hardware requirements. Missing or insufficient description of hyperparameters that need to be set or tuned to obtain the exact results. Selection of the training, test and evaluation data. Required packages and their versions. Tweaks performed in the code that's not mentioned in the paper. Methods and techniques used. Pre-processing steps. Moving on, the fair data principles not only apply to research data, but also to the tools, algorithms and workflows that lead to the results. This aids to enhance transparency, reproducibility, and reuse of the research pipeline. In the context of the current reproducibility crisis in ML, there is a definite need to explore how the fair data principles can be applied in this field. To implement fair principles regarding interoperability, it is important that there is a common terminology to describe, find, and share the research process and data sets. Describing machine learning workflows using ontologies could therefore help to query and answer competency questions like which hyperparameters were used in one particular run of the model, which libraries and their versions are used in validating the model, etc. In previous work, we have developed the ReproduceMe ontology, which is extended from Provo and PPLAN ontologies. ReproduceMe introduces the notion of data, agent, activity, plan, step, setting, instrument, and materials, and thus model the general elements of scientific experiments required for their reproducibility. Work is in progress to extend this ontology to include machine learning concepts which scientists consider important according to our survey. With ReproducMe, the machine learning pipeline developed through Jupyter Notebooks can be described in an interoperable manner. We also aim to be compliant with existing ontologies like machine learning schema and MEX vocabulary. Building a machine learning pipeline requires constant tweaks in the algorithms and models and parameter tuning. The role of randomness in machine learning experiments is big and its use is common in steps like data collection, algorithms, sampling, etc. Several runs of the model with the same data can generate different results. Thus, repeating and reproducing results and reusing pipelines is difficult. To overcome this problem, we developed ProofBook. With ProofBook, users can capture, store, describe, and compare the provenance of different execution of Jupyter Notebooks. ProofBook allows users to compare the results of the machine learning pipeline from the original author of the Jupyter Notebook in GitHub 
with a result from our own execution using ProBook. In machine learning experiments, users need to figure out the reason behind different results due to modification in data or models or because of a random sample. Therefore, it is important to describe the data being used, the code and parameters of the model, the execution environment to know how the results have been derived. ProBook helps in achieving this reproducibility level by providing the provenance of each run of the model along with the execution environment. To conclude, machine learning is said to be experiencing a reproducibility crisis. In this paper, we propose a first solution to address the underlying problem. We propose to apply fair data principles to machine learning workflows. With reproducibility ontology, we aim to describe machine learning workflows. We demonstrate the use of ProBook in achieving reproducibility in machine learning. Finally, I would like to acknowledge Fusion, a team in University of Vienna, and Carl Zeiss Foundation for the funding of this work. You could find more information on this research in the shown links. Thank you.